Exactly. It just won't happen. Their attention spans. As y'all as y'all are being recorded, we are we are looking at qxforjustice.com, which is Quinell's official website. I would love for Vatan Dunn to continue to kind of tell us a little bit more about him while we see his images. You can't see him until I upload the video after we do. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna hear your voice while you kind of tell us a little bit more about Q. Cornell. I told y'all he was throwing that reward money in his cheeks, but you go ahead. What's on? They remember they said they're gonna try to give it back. Mm -hmm. It says disclaimer, please be advised that QX Advisors Inc. is not a law firm or attorney's office, and any advice given is not a substitute for legal advice. Equal search. Yeah, Texas Equal Search. I don't think it should go to them, and here's why. Because that white man said he doesn't want amateurs, regular people searching for her, and that's because they was running out of money and they needed that reward money, so they didn't want none of us regular people to find her. That that ain't right. Right. Mm, well, wait. You saw. You saw. Yeah, I know his daughter got killed, and wasn't she? Isn't she still missing to this day? But here's my thing: just because you started off genuine doesn't mean you're genuine today. Listen, I don't, I don't really like, well, no, I'm not going to say that. Yeah. The dude who head was cut off his sons. They found him decapitated. They didn't find out his body, and they never really found out who did it. Yeah, they were trying to say it's out as tool. Some people, I mean, it's just crazy.
Yeah, because you're a real parent. And listen, let me just. Yeah, because they're going through like shock and trauma. Yeah, because something like that will change you. Make you do something like that. Let me let me let me tell y'all real fast what Quinnell X says his services are: child protective services, homicide, wrongful arrest, police misconduct, obsessive excessive force, discrimination, missing persons, racism in the court, slash jury consultation, and other. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Well, I mean, y'all. I agree. Look, he said he's getting a lot of death threats. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Because, you know, men don't like baby killers and stuff. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. You don't think he in general pop? Me never been to either one. What's the difference? Not to sound ignorant. I got time for that. I need mine to be like a private dorm room. You heard me?
So why do you think they took his uh, bail down from a million to like 40k? So you think so you think that um that Brittany Bones is gonna be arrested at some point? So Darian is not a career criminal. So basically, we're we're waiting. We're we're waiting for the warrant of Brittany Bowen's arrest at this point. So people So people You say what at the last part? Mm.
Yep, yeah, but he too busy taking pictures with her. And he only was told that she she was sick. Are you thinking he's involved? It's still going to go on my channel, so you watch it. <laughs> Right, just not put taking initiative. Like, how somebody gonna tell you your child sick so you can't take them? That's my child. Let, let, let me inter, let me interject. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
let me let me interject real fast. I want to interject and say that when we were live and we were having this conversation and it ended, I'm going to tell you how genuine these people are. They didn't say, oh, well, I don't want to do the show because ain't nobody listening. They continue to talk. So this is people speaking from their heart. I want to let y'all know that like people care for Malia more than their own parents. And it's crazy out here. Mm -hmm. So on that note, it's 11.40 p.m. I'm just happy that this happened in Texas. For the most part, I go to jurisdiction a little messed up when you dump it in Arkansas. I hope they get them in Texas and send them to Huntsville and Friday. It's your girl, Antigua and Dre. We're going to have to continue this conversation tomorrow. It's 11.40 p.m. And a sister already tipsy. But let me thank V-Dub, V-Dub, the time gun, 13 on YouTube. I also want to thank... My co-host who held it down for me, Alexis. We go continue this conversation tomorrow. Thank you too for joining the conversation. All right, y'all. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna hit y'all up. It, yay! Listen, y'all. Listen, listen, Linda. When I tell, <laughs> when I tell y'all, I got some of the best people that rock with me for real. Alexis, go on, take us on out. Tell, give me your last words. What's up now? <laughs> okay. Her name is Cash Me Out. Keep spell it. Spell it. Make sure everybody know. Okay, because I figured it wasn't a regular spelling, so so the people know. All right then, Alexis, I'm gonna hit you up tomorrow. All right, I got you. All right, all right, bye. bye. All right, y'all, it's your girl Tiffany M. Draper. Make sure you hit me up, Tiffany M. Draper at gmail.com if you have anything to say to me. Or you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram under the hashtag username Tiffany M. Draper. I'm out.